And then we're going to get on the email list, which will be, Kelly will be uploading on too, so you'll both be doing that today. And then Thursday, Friday, we're going to be doing this, which this is the back end system, um, which we have usually with a buyer, we have a product we're selling, someone buys, they're added to our buyer list. From there, they we can communicate them with them directly. Now how we're doing it is we're gonna separate it where someone is coming, they buy a cow product, and then they're added to three separate lists. One list is our store-wide list, so anyone who buys from 19th will be added to this, this list. One will be a niche-specific list, so anything that they, if anyone buys any cow products, they're added to the cow niche list. They'll also be added to this product-specific list, so they buy the cow happy shirt, they're on there. Each of these lists we're going to weave together in our sequence so that the store list is pushing people, the brand, getting them back to the store. That's its whole main goal. So once or twice a, week, a month we'll send an email like here's our best selling products this month or here's our featured products or here's a story about us. So that'll be the store wide focus. If I, go, if I go through the sequence you'll see it. Niche specific, we're going to be doing the box deals on these next week. So this will be our main niche specific push. So all those emails We'll be pushing the box deal, which this month, this today, this week we set it up since we don't have the box deals, we'll be pushing collections. And then the three, the product list is going to be pushing whatever product fits that opening product. So if it's a cow happy shirt, we'll push the cow care shirt. You know, that'll be the main product focus. So those are three lists we'll be setting up with each product. Every product we sell, we're going to have this in place. For now, this week we're going to set up our top two, our best selling shirt. And then our new trip wires, that's all we'll set that for. But then for the next month, we got to set up for every single product. So pretty much our autoresponder sequence will go like this when someone buys. Right away, they're sent a welcome email. This is on the store list. Um, and I'll show you how to set this all up on active campaign so it goes into sequence or whatever. But on the welcome email, it says, hey, welcome for joining here on the newsletter. We're going to right away get out all the shit that's been causing problems. So if they need to know how to look up an order, or if they're, we'll sell them, if you ordered a free shipping necklace, it can take four to six weeks because it comes internationally. We'll touch on all those little points that they might contact us about, just trying to get out of the way. And then that gives them a reason if they don't want to be on the newsletter, they can just unsubscribe. It's not a problem. So that'd be the, the day one, right when they sign up, this is sent to them. The very next day, we're going to send a product specific promotion to that list. So we'll have an email set up the day after sent on the product list. So the cow happy, this will be promotion promoting the cow care. Sure. Day three, we'll set up a niche specific questionnaire. What do you want to see in this niche? I'll give us an idea how to move from there. Day six, product specific. We're going to set up a time special offer. And you know, this will be the box offer when we have it up, where we say like you can join this month for five dollars, and we'll give them five days from day six to day eleven to buy that product at that five dollar price. And then day nine, we'll get them back into the collections and just kind of go from there. So what we're going to be doing today, I'm writing all these emails for the cows, and then you'll have those templates to follow for the goats and the pigs, and then next week we'll do the rest. Um, so this is tomorrow and Friday. Today.